time to start your hovercrafts at UBC Okanagan. So tonight we're running the annual second year engineering design competition. The point of this competition is that second year engineering students are bringing together their technical skills taught in various courses into a design setting. And this year's design setting is to design a hovercraft to serve the Okanagan Farmers Consortia, a fictional organization that's looking to improve the effectiveness and efficiency of their farming practices in the Okanagan using a semi-autonomous craft. It can be quite challenging actually, specifically because the constraints given to these students have been very broad. There's been very little limitation. Quite a bit of creativity is allowed here. Not only is the hovercraft supposed to navigate an obstacle course and run by itself, but it's also supposed to be deploying payloads throughout the course with increased accuracy. So there's a lot of activities that's supposed to be going on. We started to do our initial CAD models around mid-January. By the end of January, we were into simulations. Uh, in February, we were given our raw materials to start building and from there we start to construct the hovercraft. We're going to do well likely in the design category just because we've got a lot of innovation. We've actually got a closed loop control system. We've really been pushing the technology side of it. Uh, we're not so sure how it's going to do overall in the run, but we're hoping for the best. The hovercrafts will be judged on speed, how much weight they can carry, and whether or not they can make it through the obstacle course. For Cast in That News, I'm Madison Earhart in Kelowna.